I uh, had to pull the motor down. Um, wasn't too bad because I didn't have the carburetors on. All I had to do was uh, undo the pinch bolt on the on the drive shaft um, and just pull a few connections out, take the exhaust pipes out, and uh, undo the uh, mounting bolts. And the reason that I had to do that was one, um, I wanted to put the water bottle in. Um, I was going to use a uh, an aftermarket type of uh, aluminium water bottle, but uh, I decided against it. I fixed the um, uh, original specimen bottle, and uh, I'm going to hook that on. The other thing is that someone pointed out that my um, Pulsa uh, cover gasket uh, didn't have the proper um, slot for the breather and uh, a very observant viewer yeah his name escapes me but I'll see if I can post it up and say thank you um, so here's the pulse cover that came off and these TI models have a little breather right there with a hose that goes up and then down and has to drain somewhere I think they usually drain into the airbox, but if you don't have an airbox, you can use a filter or something like that. Um, best not to let it just drain onto the road because you can get onto the tire. Um, and that's where the breather connects to the internal part of the engine. So this gasket was blocking it off. And what it should have had is a little slot, like so. So when I turn it around, it would have coincided with that and that's what they look like so uh, yeah thank you very much um, I'll remember your name in a minute um, so I'm just going to replace this uh, put the water bottle back on and uh, put the engine back on Yep, so I've got the pulsar cover back on with a new gasket. Put the water bottle in and uh, I painted it black and just left a little bit of uh, white there so you could see the uh, green liquid for a top up. The hoses are connected, there's one on the top, uh, that's the drain, and there's one on the bottom, uh, and that's coming from the uh, top of the radiator the overflow. Right, I'll mount the engine back on. Right, excuse the cables. Um, there's the water bottle and uh, you'll see I just left a little bit of white there so you can see what the uh, level is. The Pulsar cover has a new gasket and I've replaced that and I remounted the engine and uh, just a little note I had a bit of trouble getting it lined up with the starter motor in place and I, then I realized that um, when I put it in the, on the first time it was pretty bare and I didn't have the starter motor on so I removed it and it just went on quite easily so um, back on track. <laughs> 